All right, everybody. And we're back. We're back to Tears of the Kingdom. We're still up in the tutorial area. I haven't touched the game at all since the last time I was here trying to get down. Back to the Temple of Time. Huh. We've got Ascend, which is pretty sweet. I'm trying my best over here. <laughs> Well managed, though. Okay. Let me take a quick look at where I'm. Huh. Weird. Okay. So used to being able to teleport that when I can't I get confused. Alright, so we're gonna go on an adventure. That adventure is trying my very best to get down. This water is deadly cold, we can't swim in it. So we're gonna have to figure our way out. Hello! Uh I'm gonna read that as manual V death the best. <laughs> Welcome to the stream. We're trying to, our best to get down. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> Welcome to the stream, Croatian girl. We're having a good time. We're gonna get off this rock. We're gonna do it. I don't have a paraglider. <laughs> but it's okay. We'll find our way across. Is this, is this choppable? Will this grant me... That is the wrong thing. Will this grant me a tree? Oh, thank goodness. Okay, okay, I got a plan. That's not my plan. I got an ultra hand plan. It's not a good plan. It's not gonna work up here. Okay, okay, we gotta get down. Oh, never mind. I see the fan boats down there. All right. There's no way I can reach one of those. Hmm. But maybe this water's warm enough to swim in? I guess we're about to find out. Or I'm about to have to build something to get us across. Looks pretty chilly. It's probably pretty chilly. All right, chat says go for it. We're going in. Nope, too cold. <laughs> A little bit too chilly. All right. I should have known because I was too cold. Oh my goodness. Okay. I'll do this again. So I've been informed by friends of mine that there is a better way to get down here and that what I missed up above is that there is a spot where you can uh, find some, some Zonai devices that let you sort of glide down. I didn't do that. So uh, now... That is a bit too dangerous for me to try to climb down. So now I'm walking back. When I get off this island, when I finally get off Tutorial Island, I'm going to make as quick a beeline as I can for Kakariko Village, if it even still exists, because what I want is stealth armor. I've said it before, I'll say it again, I need stealth armor to live. Come on, show me the prompt. Or don't, I guess. I'll just bunny hop my way down. There we go. Alright, we've got a plan here. <laughs> We're gonna do this.
Good work, Snow. I don't know if Snow actually cushions your fall, but I assume it does. At least a tiny bit. Okay. So we don't jump in the water this time. That's important. Mm -hmm. I was kind of hoping. Just kind of hoping that the boat that I took over here was down here, but it's not. So we're going to have to make one ourselves. Yeah, we're going to have to make one ourselves because I'm not going around the other way. All right. That is the wrong thing. <laughs> Ahem. My goodness. I swear I know how to play this game. This is what I get <laughs> for only playing once a week. Forget all the buttons immediately. There. Okay. One more. You can make one more, right? I believe in you, Stone Axe. Excellent. Ahem. There we go. Alright, we're gonna make ourselves a boat. It's time. It's not gonna be the most graceful of boats. Wow. <laughs> Amazing. Alright, boxes. My poor master sword. Oh, it's not gonna use this for that. Let's try again. That's the ticket. Uh -huh, uh -huh. None of this is super useful. Oh, wait, you are. So an I charge. Heck yeah, let's go. Okay. Now, did I think to have any zone I divide? I did. I only need the one, though. This boat's ugly enough as it is. We're not going to mess around with it too much. There's engineering, and then there's whatever this is. Can I stand on this? That's the next question. Yeah, okay, good enough. Ham. Come on! <laughs> Dang it! <laughs> Link, why are you like this? I really should save when I get back down there this time. Alright. Alright. New plan. We're not doing that anymore. How did I even get down here? This is a lot of ice. How did I get down here? Did I trap myself? Ah, uh, who knows. If I can ascend over here. Because I might be better off trying to go up and then coming back down somehow. Let's learn. Okay. That's quite the jump! Okay. Oh, hey, look at that! This is the thing! The thing I was informed of! This will make it loads easier! In that we'll actually be able to get down! Oh, it looks so helpful! Oh, 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 okay. Okay. Uh, which way am I going? No, no, wait, that's the way. That's the way. Okay, I found it. Is 
This thing doesn't... No, this thing probably definitely runs out. Whoa! Momentum! <laughs> Guess what? If you step off a moving thing, you fall. <laughs> All right. Huh. What a what a graceful dive. All right, up we go. We're going to get off this crazy rock and we're going to go I don't know. I've seen people build some wild things in this game. I want to build robots too. I don't know the plot. Other than there is princess save princess. That's always the plot with Zelda's. Let's go. Up. Up up up. Okay. Now let's go see Raru, who's voiced by uh, the voice actor for a different video game character who I care very deeply for. We're finally allowed to open the door! Yesterday, or yesterday, goodness. Last Friday, I tried so hard to get in the door, and it was so tricky. Oh, I have control of myself. That's good. Hey, shiny thing. Does this belong to me now? Is this the tier? One of the tiers of the kingdom for which this game is named? Is that what this is? Well, this is certainly interesting and weird. Oh no. We've already met. Why does she want to shake hands with us? <laughs> oh! <laughs> She's making something happen. My controller's vibrating about it. Oh. That's nice. Huh. Hmm, there was space for more. Hmm. Okay, so remember how outside on the door there were these seven indentations? And this is called the Temple of Time. Seven is a very important... Ooh, that's going to be so useful. That's going to be ridiculous. I'm going to do wild things with recall. Um, hmm. Ah, recall. The ability to reverse the movement of an object through time. Just in case I hadn't read its description. Just in case. And Zelda has vanished as well. Yeah, I know. Hmm. What you just saw, it's a mystery even to me. Perhaps it was a sort of echo, one that reflects her sheer will. Yeah, she's real determined. Hmm. That you've now been given this ability, no doubt it will prove important. I'll bet I'm going to climb those gears. That's what I'm going to do. Basically immediately. I wanted to climb the ones in the Shrine of Resurrection. Er, that's not what it's called. But I wanted to climb those ones and couldn't do it. Okay. Ah, 
Ah, I see what I'm meant to do here. Bang. Okay. Yeah, I get it. I get it. Let's go. Okay, we got this this time. And let's open this door. Got handprints in it. Oh, it's one of these, like drawing the master sword. The door stands as a test of your own overall vitality. That makes sense. In the original game, you couldn't draw the Master Sword until you went and got, um... Until you went and got enough hearts to do it. In your weakened state, you're not yet strong enough to open it. That's true. There's one more shrine on the island. There you can get another blessing. Alright, let's go. Gotta pray to the goddess statue and all that. Here you go, buddy. Oh, thank goodness. I was waiting so patiently to be able to teleport to different places. And it was so annoying that I couldn't. Okay. Okay, where's our new shrine? It's up there. Well, up to the Room of Awakening we go. I forgot that's what it was called. Finally climb these things? Am I allowed? <laughs> ascend, descend, descend! <laughs> ascend, descend, descend with Goob! Uh, I love Hollow Knight. Maybe someday Silk Song will come out too. What? This whole thing was that? Okay. Okay, we're fine. Nobody's dead. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, I see it. Okay. Woo! I made it to whatever this is. It's a mystery. Is this gonna be a Korok or something? It's always a Korok or something. That's what I've determined. Oh! Helpful! The shrine! Hey, a friend! Are you a friend? Yeah, you're a friend robot! Friend robot! This is a crystal refinery. Nice! Oh! At least a hundred, huh? Yeah, it's not, not happening right yet. Shrine! It's shrine time! Mm. So, so these shrines, these shrines show up like this in a big old pile of sand, and they got this kind of texture to them. Oh, I get it. It kind of looks like a Zen garden. I'm on to you now. 
For a second, I thought it was mushrooms. Because mushrooms, uh, they, they kind of breathe out sand in so much as they, it's complicated. So I was worried. But no, it's Zen Garden. That's what we have here. Zen Garden architecture. Ah, we're going to learn how to rewind stuff. The thing I'm very insistent that I'm going to mess everything up with. And woo! Let's go. We're leaving. Time! It belongs to me. Whoa! There we go. We're going up. Up, up, up. Splish, splash, I was controlling time. That is a treasure. And then I got dropped off at the box. Yay! The box was arrows. Okay. Always gotta look for treasures. Oh, what? Oh, no, I see exactly what I'm meant to do here. There we go. That's the ticket. It just took a second for me to get it all lined up. But we got it. Alright, we can skip this. I forgot. I'm just dripping wet, like, casually in here. <laughs> their own fault. They put all that water in the shrine. It's a wet shrine. Not as wet as the Cryonis shrine in the first game. I'm honest to goodness surprised I don't have like Cryonis or something back, but I guess it makes sense. This game doesn't seem like it's going to have those abilities. Yeah, I don't care about that. I care about the map. Let me out. We're finally getting off this island. It's only taken me four hours plus however long it's been now. It's only taken me like a while. <laughs> but we're doing it. They say every cave is home to a bubble frog. We're going to find him. Delicious, delicious frogs. Is there water down there? Can I get down this way? Yes. More or less safely. Ah, uh, I almost died on a lily pad awkwardly. Oh no. Soldier robot, please. I'm busy. I uh, no, sir, I have things to do. They do not involve this. Goodbye, sir. Ooh, mushrooms. Ooh, mushrooms. Ooh, mushrooms. Okay, let's get the heck off this this island. We're getting off this rock. <gasps> Splish! I have once again uh, suddenly remembered how to put the buttons in this game. I was playing Splatoon so much, uh, trying to push for S+, that I forgot how to operate the other game. This one. 
the one that I'm playing right now. <laughs> Alright. Are we finally going to be allowed to leave? Go to the surface? The ground? Probably going to be a long time till we get back to the sky. We're getting off this rock. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Oh, she's glowing. I can offer her some stuff now. I'm glad she's willing to take these instead of, like, the shrine thingies from the first game. They're lights of blessing. Give me a heart container because it won't let me have stamina, which is sensible. It's literally plot relevant that I get a heart container. <laughs> Well, a little bit of gloopy darkness gone. Woo! Do, do, do. <laughs> okay, this time we're gonna do it. He better not come back and be like, there's another shrine for you. Nice. We pushed that. No wonder it took hearts. Those doors are big. All right. Let's see what we got here. We're a shorty. Good. I see you have managed to open the door. You haven't fully recovered yet, but that is to be expected. You're almost beyond saving. By visiting the shrines and receiving their blessings, you have mitigated some of the corruption's effects. Though our time together has been brief, I am so happy that we finally met. Aww. You are exactly as Zelda said. Done everything I can for her. Now it is up to you. Okay. Well, goodbye, Rome. Or, um, <laughs> Raru. Um. Okay. Whoa. Alright, alright. We're good so far. Okay, I'm on to you now. I'm on to you. And then we swim through the earth. Same trick. Yeah. I admit I'm a little nervous about falling, but hopefully at the end of this there's a paraglider and then I can glide down. What's this? What's this? What's this orb? Orb. Could be anything. Shiny. Huh. My controller's vibrating a little again. Huh. 
B's got things to say. She's probably trying to tell him his controller needs to be charged. Whoa. Sword's leaving. dragon. Oh! Oh, is that, uh, um, Nadra, I guess? The wisdom dragon? Find me. Okay. Well, there is Princess. Save Princess. So far is still the plot. Um, but how do I get down? Uh. Wait, hold on, hold on. I'm thinking. I'm thinking. Okay, this is gonna sound really silly and weird. But. Yeah. Yeah, there's water underneath me. So, what if I just... What if I just jump? What if I just go for it? need one we're just jumping off a bridge splash we landed uh do not do this ever okay okay we're in hyrule we're finally to the ground guess what everyone we made it We finally made it to the ground. Ah, oh, it's a miracle. Okay, okay, let's see what we've got around here. Oh. Which way is the wind blowing? I don't know if it affects things in this game. It did in Breath of the Wild. are gonna have burnt up oh wait all his things are gonna have burnt up I should leave his things were um fire seeds apparently or whatever those little plants were oh mushroom Woo. okay what's this Okay.
Okay, I'm going that general direction, I guess. You know what? We could get there so much faster if we built something to get there on. That is not the correct button. I got a plan. It's gonna be extremely mundane. That stood up for a surprisingly long time. Okay, okay, let's see. Okay. This is perhaps the most mundane plan I've ever come up with. I want to build cool mechs, but at the same time... <laughs> what if... No, no, not like that. <laughs> Maybe? I don't know if that wheel's gonna turn. I guess we're about to find out. We're gonna build perhaps a wagon. Perhaps not. It might not work. It won't let me push it. That's fine. We're gonna get out of his own eye device. Wrong things. Where are my own eye devices? This might work. If this works, I'm a genius. won't turn. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, well, that's too bad. Fireflies. You know what we could do? gonna catch one and ride it. You can ride things that aren't horses in this game as long as they're big enough to ride. Just ambient, are they? Where are you? I saw them. Oh, they're there. Dragonflies? back. Maybe they are just ambient. Yeah, they disappear when I get close, but not by flying away. I guess maybe they are just ambient animals. <gasps> A camp full of bokoblins. 
You know what this means. Wait a minute. That's too far back. I'm not doing it. Gonna sneak our way up on them. If we kill their watchmen, we can sneak our way into the camp. And he hasn't seen me because I'm behind a tree. We're gonna kill their watchmen as quietly as possible. So, not with a fire arrow. Uh-oh. We can't reach him from here. Don't worry, Bokoblins. Nobody's here. Go back to bed, buddy. So helpful. Ah, oh, nerds. Nobody's here. Ah, oh, darn it. No! Fine! Oh, come on now. I need to put on a normal shield. As opposed to one that will catch fire at all times. I have a lot of weird things. Ow! That's mine now. You can't have it back. I was gonna sneak strike you all to death in your sleep. It could have been better. But I did kill your watchman immediately. That was pretty sweet. Oh, what's this? Depleted by gloom when used... Uh, I don't know what gloom is. I don't know if I want to find out. Okay. I roll herbs. Okay. Bloopy! I see money in the distance. Pick that up in a second. Am I going to shoot this fox? Absolutely. Do I feel bad about it? Yes. Got him. 
All right, back for my bird bits. Bird bits. Now, Bloopy. So for those of you who don't know, this is a Bloopy. And Bloopies are full to the brimming with money. Full of bats. Excuse me? What the heck? Link, get up. Link, I don't know what that was, but we're going back in there to find out. Well, first we're going to eat something real quick. I faked a lot. I faked too much. We'll eat a couple of apples. There we go. Okay, so there is something in there. That's not what I wanted. Where is it? Okay, I saw its little question mark. Oh, I see it, I see it. What the heck is that thing? I hated that. I hated the noises it made. Horrible. Well, I hated everything about that. Cook it in a dish to give a glowing effect to anyone who eats it. Why do I need to glow? I guess at night. What are my bows like? Oh, <laughs> yeah, all right. Okay, okay, so far so good. What's this? Where are these glowy mushroom boys? Bright bloom. We know what bright blooms are for. We used them up in the, uh... We used them up upstairs oh that explains it I'm on the wrong one okay yeah we used them upstairs in the mine I remember that get rid of anything. That stick. Okay. We found a weird cave. Let's get out of the weird cave. We don't need to stay here. Ooh, a shrine! But shrine... Yes, there's plot that way, probably, but shrine! Oh no. I've become slowed. Uh, Paradon? Young man, there's a place you can go. I said, young man. Fruits are dangerous. Someone could get hurt with those. That worked. What did it provide me? A chickaloo tree nut. 
So none of the bird, all of the bird's tummy. Oh, a hot air balloon. What the heck is that? Why is that like that? That seems like it should not be that way. Just saying. Perhaps a giant hole in the ground is not what we want. Especially when it looks like it's got malice leaking out of it. Oh, maybe in this game it's gloom. That would make sense. Alright, let's go. I know I said I was going to be lined for Kakariko, but then I got distracted because there was a shrine down here. And it's only natural that I should be eh, distracted when there's a shrine afoot. Shape rotation. Oh, no. And where does this go? The square hole. What about this one? This triangle piece. That's right. The square hole. I see, I see. So far, we're good. Treasure! Oh, wait. Ah! I see. Okay, okay, I see, I see. Mmm, turning bias. Delicious. Treasure! What's in here? Anything good? Pretty good. Okay, we need to make this shape. Oh, oh, I think I accidentally got it. <laughs> Don't like that. Like this? Yeah, like that. Yeah, we did it. Yay! We're in. And we're in. Look at that. Alright, I don't care about that. It's really pretty music, though. A light of blessing, and more importantly, a teleport point. Maybe there's a shrine where the plot is. Yeah. That does not look healthy. Hey, you, you sound okay. I'd stay away from that stuff if you care about your health. Folks are calling it gloom. If you get any on you, you'll start losing your strength, like it's sapping your life away. Hmm. In the depths, with a capital D. That must be what's down the hole. Uh, 
Oh. Well, Bonnie, I hope you get better soon. Hello. Oh, Devon. Has an investigation? Oh, the upheaval. Okay. Filled with mystery. Who's Joshua? Oh. Yep. Okay, I see. Oh. Well. All I heard was jump in a hole. That's ground. What a good rip, though. On the way into the hole. Oh, I like that. Boong. That's good. They should replace... They should replace... Uh... The movie trailer noise with that sound. Horse! Horse! Oh, what beautiful horse! Horses! I want that horse in particular. That horse isn't a pono, but I would like to ride it. Oh, come back, horse! What about you? <laughs> Ow! I deserved that, y'all. I absolutely deserved that. That just makes me want this horse even more. Be very, very quiet. That's the horse I want over there, actually. But you didn't see nothing, horse. That horse kicked me in the face. I want that horse. We're gonna catch us a horse. Let's go. We gotta be very, very quiet. We're hunting horses. No, horse! Don't scare the other horse! That horse is a big dumb jerk. horse now <laughs> wait wait I want to see something We're going to plot horse. 
Where's that apple go? Well, that's certainly important. What do you want to bet that's a Korok? That's definitely a Korok. But there's apples! Apples for my horse! Is a Korok. Let me up. <sighs> Come on. Oh, okay. Aha! Is there another one? Oh. <laughs> Koroks. We all love them. Okay, bye-bye. That horse, that horse doesn't listen to me yet, but it will. Horse, horse, these are for you. I'm gonna name her Buttercup. This is Buttercup the horse. And what a beautiful horse she is. Oh, actually, while I'm up here, I'm going to change my armor around a little bit. I don't need the hot, I don't need those pants. Coming up on something. People! Looks like a city. <laughs> I just rode into town. Oh, maybe there's a stable here. I see horses. Okay. Purr is freaking out. She's over here. Ah. Buttercup! Where did she go? You better give me back my horse. <laughs> Sir, let me... <sighs> but I want to stable my horse. Buttercup, come inside. We'll have to be careful walking around inside. I just can't leave her out there. She might get hurt. Oh, she won't go that way. Okay, where are we going, Buttercup? Oh, we're not going out there. I got her doing a little canter. Oh. 
Robbie! Robbie! Oh, he's still a little old man. I was honestly kind of figuring he'd be like, like, um, like, somehow a child. I don't know. That seems like the thing to do. Alright, let's go see Pura. Last time I saw her, she was six years old. But also a hundred. Dog looks busy. You're not Pura. You're not Pura at all, unless she's had a really weird redesign. Oh, Joshua! Okay, 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 we're, we're here. Let's go. Okay, now where have you been? Linky, you're not a ghost, are you? Jinkies! <laughs> that looks interesting. <laughs> I know she's probably not voiced by uh, Velma, but she sounds like she's voiced by literally step at a time. any of the good Velmas. What exactly happened? <sighs> Look at her. She's beautiful. So when you and Princess Zelda go beneath Hyrule Castle, you discover a mysterious mummy which suddenly reanimates. Mm-hmm. Yes, that happened. Then Zelda falls into a fissure and vanishes. Bloop. That must have been when the castle rose and the ruins fell. <sighs> Imagine if they'd given us playable Zelda, then, the cowards. later, you wake up on a sky island, saved by the arm that was stuck to the mummy. You get the Pura pad from an unusual creature. And learn that your new arm belonged to someone named Rari. The Master Sword disappears. You hear the princess's voice and find your way. Here. That about sums it up, yes. Huh? What? Are you saying you came from up there? I sure did. I dove down here. Ah, Rauru was the first king of Hyrule. Yeah, that tracks. With what Zelda said when we were downstairs. They're the Zonai. Yeah, we're not going in there. Ah. I definitely did. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Yes. Oh, her old design from when she was like six years old. Yeah. Oh, I love that. I'm glad they included that in here. Okay. You know, I still haven't got my paraglider yet. Let's go, Buttercup! We're off to an adventure. Excuse me, folks. I will try not to run over anybody. I want my paraglider. Is that a shrine? I know I should be going over. But, but shrine! And I don't think I've been to it yet. Is that river? No, that's road. Yeah. Let's go, Buttercup! Oh, oh. What a good horse. Yeah. 
Me and Buttercup riding along. Wait, hold on. What's this guy? What, what, what is happening over here? He's all lit up. Here, Buttercup, you, you stay there for a second. What's going on here, buddy? Is... Okay. That's the guy who built, like, my house. I think. In, uh, in Breath of the Wild. Oh! <laughs> in the middle of President Hudson's epic tale of heroism. It's to put up signs all over. Okay. Alright, Addison, let's go. We'll put some signs up with you. Okay, yeah, I see that. Ah. Uh, blood moons are still a thing. No, wait, don't! Darn it! Okay. You know, I'm gonna solve this in the easiest way possible. I have a sneaking suspicion that I can just literally put a stick under it. Like... I'm pretty sure I can just do this. Yep. How's the president standing? I propped him up like a sensible person. How are you going to stand this up, buddy? You don't seem like you know how to... He doesn't seem like he knows how to construct. Ooh, money. <laughs> Ooh, rice balls. Okay. A pup shroom. Oh! I love puff mushrooms. I have no idea what their deal is, but they're fun to step on. Buttercup! Why do you build me up? Buttercup, come back here. Come back here, Buttercup. We're not going that way, Buttercup. Nope, nope, nope. Thank you, Buttercup. What a good horse you are. Look at you, following the road like a good horse. What a good horse. I hate that. Me too, Buttercup. We'll just let this go. What is that? Witness the blood moon's rise. Okay. I am witnessing. I am seeing it. Red glow shines upon the land. I am seeing it. 
The endless spirits of slain monsters return to flesh. I won't let me skip it, because this is the first time I've seen it. Just as they did. Oh, yeah, there's definitely time travel here, chat. Uh, there's definitely time travel here. I know it hasn't been confirmed, but there's certainly time travel. We, uh, when we were up on Sky Island, we took what was left of our Master Sword, we put it in a glowing gold orb, and it orbed away, and Zelda, elsewhere, at a different time of day, received the sword from the glowing gold orb. So there's certainly some time travel here. This is my horse. Her name is Buttercup. I need to take her to a stable to register that fact. Stay here, Buttercup. I thought that the town I went to when I started would have a stable in it, but it doesn't. Or if it does, I'm not allowed to use it. Technically, I am supposed to be heading to Hyrule Castle, but I wanted to take Buttercup with me. We're on an adventure. She looks like a Buttercup. She's got like a she's got like a yellow mane, like a Buttercup. And we're being trained we're being taught how to throw stuff. Okay. Oh, I've seen okay. This is a tutorial shrine. We're gonna throw things at this robot. The shrine purifies the ancient evil. You who have entered here, heed my instruction. You got it. Aim true and throw the material. Okie dokie. I think that's R. Your other attacks are ineffective here. Ready yourself. Okay. Ow! Uh, that's close. We did it. I'm still in my, like, fun dress from up on the mountain. I'll get new armor sooner or later. What I want to do is beeline for Kakariko. See, um... Ouch! I expect Kakariko to have, um... The ninja armor? Because it had the ninja armor in the first game. And the ninja armor makes you stealthy. So you can sneak up on enemies and sneak strike them. And I do love a good sneak strike. And a good headshot. Now we can replace the fire fruit I used with more fire fruit. I want that charge. If it doesn't let me have that charge, I will... Oh, there's a hammer. Ladder. Wow, I don't know how I got hammer from ladder. A mystery to be sure. Oh, resonates with Sonai devices to slightly increase its attack power. Okay. So if I drop this, and I take that, and then I go outside and put a Zonaiite device on it, flowers Whee! we don't have to stay here for this we can skip it yes yes thank you yeah hearts full we're blessed Full of love. <sighs> I don't know the rest of that song from Les Mis. Because I didn't care about that particular set of things. Shooting star! Buttercup, we got places to be. What 
come back for this cherry tree. Okay, okay. So, shooting stars are going to be here until 5 o'clock. They glow on the map. It's of grave import that I get to it before it goes out. Don't care about this. We're leaving. Let's go, buttercup. I don't see it anywhere. I know I saw it fall. It might be on the other side of the shrine. Okay. Okay. Sorry, Buttercup. Be good. Oh, no. Oh. One sec. Chad, do you see anything glowing out here? Because I think it probably just fell in the water. Ah, I hear something trying to get at me. Oh! All right, you bony boy. That's what you get. Where's your friend? I see your friend. Your friend's a coward. Ah, uh, excuse me, sir. Why not? <laughs> All right, we're going to do the wildest thing. We're going to take a Bacoblin arm. And we are going to glue it. To a Bacoblin arm. <laughs> 40 power. Amazing. Now, we're going to activate the shrine. I'm going to be sad that I did not get the shooting star. Because it landed in the water and therefore just, like, imploded upon itself. I should go back to the castle. What's this shrine about? Also, second reason it's not Clip Clop is because uh, that's too many Rick and, Rick and Morty reference. Mm. Too much of a Rick and Morty reference. We're not going to do that tonight. Backtrack. What? What? Oh. Okay, I see. Does she look silver to you? Because she isn't. If I find a white horse, I'll name her Silver, I suppose. Hmm, I figured it out. Okay. Ah, I see what we're doing here. I have an idea, y'all. There's treasure over there. Okay, well, first what we're going to do is this. <laughs> I suppose it would, in fact, be ironic. We are going to go over there and get that treasure, but it's not because we're not going to carry the torch back. I want the treasure, though.
clunk. That's worth taking. Now then, we could hypothetically swim back. We're not gonna, though. We're gonna swim part of the way. Oh, I guess we're not. Wow. Water's current is too strong. We can rewind time in this game. It's great. Okay, what what are we supposed to do here? Huh, there is ball, put ball in the hole. You got it. Wait. And hypothetically, from over here, can I hit it? Yeah, I totally can. There it goes. Yeah, you have to have the top one green too, so we just, we rewound time. To make it go here. Oh, well, we better check the back for treasure. You always get to check behind the shrine for treasure. Sometimes they hide good stuff like diamonds back there. Whoop! Alright, me and Buttercup are going back, though. Because I still don't have a paraglider, and that concerns me deeply. Yeah! All right, let's go. Do, do, do. I might stream a bit tomorrow too. There's a golden rotation and salmon run this weekend and I'm very excited for that because it means it's all Grisco weapons all the time. Now, where did I leave Buttercup? Buttercup! 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 You know what we could- you know what we should color? We should color Peanut Buttercup. She kind of looks like one. isn't really a road, is it? Buttercup, what are you doing? Where where are we going? <coughs> well, that used to be a road. But I think I saw something I can alter hand. Heck! Yes! It's treasure! Yep. Bright bloom seeds. Make it bright out. Huh. Alright. Let's go, Buttercup. Huh. Huh. We got places to be, man. You look out for those bad, bad mans. Uh. Um. I don't know what's going on, but I don't want to find out. Let's leave. What was that? 
Okay. We're getting the heck out of Dodge. Sorry, lady. I was very frightened of whatever that was. That's for Koblenz. Wait, where are we? Okay, so something over there is dangerous. I'm going to mark that appropriately. I don't know what it is, but we're marking it so I don't forget. Yeah. Anyway, we're not where I want to be yet, and I don't want to. Yeah. I don't want to deal with these Koblenz. Let's go. Oh. Nope, yeah. nope. Sorry, Bo Koblenz. I got places to be. I'm leaving. Yeah. Ah. Why am I running into everything dangerous today? Yeah. That's a battle yeah. talus. I don't know what a battle talus is as opposed to a regular talus. Yeah. But that's what it is. I don't like it. Okay. We are finally back to something resembling safety, y'all. Not exactly safety, but it's better. Buttercup, you did it. <laughs> Hero horse. Hero horse saves local <laughs> local man. Okay, no, down here. Down here, sweetie. Yep, that's right. Can you make this jump? Yeah. No. Oh, she wouldn't do it. Perfectly good shrine, right here. I see it. I don't like to stop them and make them be scared. What do you think? Hyrule Chasm is nearby. Yes, I'm familiar. I jumped into it and died. <laughs> yes. Yes, Rome had a big one. I, I know what the chasm is. <sighs> Let's open this up. <laughs> Alright, let's go on in. This is the umpteenth shrine I've done. And I still don't have my glider. I would like a paraglider, thank you. It's got to be in this game. Like, they're not going to put me in a game where I jump down giant chasms and not give me a glider, right? That would be crazy. Am I supposed to, like, put fan down ahead of me or something? Or, like, build a Zonai jet plane? Guess could say. Hmm? Oh, it's a combat trial. I get it. I'm on to you now. Heed my instruction. You got it, strange mystery voice. You got it. Let's go. Side hop to avoid enemy attacks. Yes, yes. Come on. One hop this time. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, darn. You'll have to let me equip something. I want to do a backflip. I'm going to do sweet tricks. Backpedal and jump. Okay. First. No, wait. No, it doesn't matter. Let's use this. Ouch. A repel attack if you yeah that makes sense we could repel guardian lasers in the first game okay you got it okay 
sword spin. That's what I heard. You got it. I can play the video game. That's what this shrine told me. Let me go. Yeah, and they helpfully put the treasure right here in combat one so that you don't have to go looking for it because you already just fought your way through. That's helpful of them. Oh, is that my ice sword? No. Let's get rid of this because I think that's the big long boy. I don't like two-handed weapons very well. I just like to have a shield. Then again, I can be convinced. I could tape a sword to a sword and have the biggest possible sword. The sword, sword, sword. We could do it. It could be amazing. Sweet. I got another light of blessing. That's the fourth one. We're doing it. Slow down. Or don't. Oh, those gates are shut. <laughs> Buttercup, I'm sorry. You're a good horse. Well, I guess we're climbing our way around. I sure do hate how much malice there is over here. It's me! <laughs> this area is off limits when we conduct our search for Princess Zelda and Link. You can't just come wandering in here like that. Guys, guys, I'm Link. It's you! Hello! Okay, Captain Hawes, huh? I can't take the horse around the gate because she won't come this way. She can't jump it, and I'm not t trying to trot her around there. It'd be really awkward. If I can make it around, it'd take me like a 16,000 point turn or something silly. Sir, can I go in that hall? Uh, can I go in? Hello, sir. Oh? It can't be him. It's definitely me. <sighs> All right. Back in Breath of the Wild, this was the final dungeon. Not that there were dungeons in Breath of the Wild. Exactly. I know where the first gatehouse is. Um... There used to be a Lionel in it. Oh. <laughs> fall off the gatehouse? I don't want him to fall off. <sighs> it didn't break. I threw it, but it did not break. Okay, let's keep going. We can do this. What's up there, buddy? Okay. First gatehouse, Hyrule Field. That's not Captain Hawes at all. He's up there somewhere. <sighs> We're going to have to climb. I'm going to use a stool. Grab 
gremlin. I'm going full gremlin mode. I'm a gremlin. Come on now, Link. I'm a gremlin and that's okay. Sir, I think you might be Captain Hawes because you've got a funny hat. <laughs> I'm alive. Shocking. Shocking! Yes, sir, I'm a wizard. Okay. The sheer amount of gloom has gotten overwhelming. Our work carries on, but we've been a bit dead in the water. Okay, that makes sense. Is it? What? She's alive? Oh, there is definitely time travel. Huh? Ma'am, come back. Mm -hmm. I did. Mm. Okay, I'll go tell Para. I literally just walked up here to walk back. Uh, no, maybe we don't climb down that way. I feel like I'll just flop on my face and, like, die. <laughs> how do I even get up here in the first- oh, right. I know how to climb the gatehouse. I've been here before. There we go. <sighs> Back we go. This no, this is the way. It's just dumb. I wish I could, like, skateboard down this. There's this technique called shield surfing, but the shield I'm wearing is not gonna let me do it. Maybe this will. Nope. Awful. If only I could put like some wheels on it. <gasps> I wonder... No, there's no way you can... But what if you can? I... Maybe I need to go up to Sky Island for a second. I want to know something. And the thing I want to know is maybe I don't have wheels. But what if I put a minecart on my shield? Could I even carry a minecart around like that? Would it let me do it? Wait, no, Buttercup! Oh, I can't leave Buttercup up here. It's too dangerous for a little horse. Come here, Buttercup. <laughs> okay, let's go back. Let's go back to the town. We got a little ways off. I got a little wild in my adventures and wandered away, but that's how open world games are. Wait, hold on, hold on. Ma'am, please. Thank you. I 
we're gonna help this man. He's not a smart man. But he is, in fact, trying his best, question mark. Buttercup! Oh, it's raining. Well, not to worry. Here, try that. I think it's leaning good enough. I gotta get my horse out of the rain. Ah! Right? Money. <laughs> I love money. Excellent. <sighs> this guy gets around. Pony points. Whoa. Okay, bye. Do we build me up? Silent Princess. What's this? Oh, the Calamity was a thing that happened in the first game. Calamity Ganon rose up and did Calamity Ganon things. It was pretty bad. Is that... Okay. <laughs> Alright, Buttercup. I'm sorry you're out in the rain like this. I will take you back to Hyrule Castle Town, such as it is. Let's go, we're gonna run over this fox! Oh, we missed. I'm gonna park the horse under... Oh, we're not allowed in that way. Okay. We'll go around. And we'll pick our way carefully. Jump. She's trying to go back to the stable naturally. This game had better not make me lose Buttercup. I think I just need to find a stable really fast. That's that'll be my next goal. Once I get Paraglider, I'm gonna find a stable. And there's probably one on the way to Kakariko, so we'll just follow the road until we catch one. Hmm. Okay, yes, I saw a thing. She believes me. That's good of her. <gasps> yep, you can. What are you going to do for it? Yay! Mm -hmm. Skyview Tower, huh? Mm -hmm. Okay. It's working. That's a cave. She calls us Winky. Mm -hmm. Okay. <gasps> Clothes are at Mub's shop. Okay. 
Well, let's go see what we can see. Okay, we'll start here. Yeah, it's me. Scorpus. Huh. Tunk tunk. Knock knock, who's there? It's me. I'm Link. Knockity knock knock. <laughs> we slide down. Very nice. She's right. Oh, she's from Kakariko. We don't know where the dust comes from. It's a mystery. Yellow plant stuff from the gloom specialist. Oh! Napping. Oh. <laughs> I know what chasms are. It really wants me to know what chasms are. We'll take a look at that in a second. That's a big old map. No. Nope. Healthy cooking, huh? Oh. Romano. They put me in charge of the cooking for some reason. Fruit and mushroom ricks, huh? I've got apples. Mm -hmm. I do love that this game, if you have the thing, tells you you've got the thing and just lets you complete the quest. It does not make you go back through. That's amazing. That's a regular success at cooking. How nice. Yeah. Looks tasty. Okay, what have you got to tell me about? Hmm? Hmm? Oh. Yeah, what's on here? It looks like places. Like, that looks like Goron Mountain, down in the bottom corner. Yeah, okay. Is uh, Gerudo Valley, and then up there's where presumably the Rito live, and then the Korok Forest in the middle. Tell me about the towns and villages. I know about the people. Okay. Let's see what we've got. Lookout Landing. That's us. Rito Village. Okay, so it's still in the same place. Gerudo Town is also still in the same place. That tracks. Oh, Terra Town! I don't think I have Breath of the Wild data on this uh, particular machine. But I think I have Breath of the Wild data on my account somewhere. I wonder if that changes how Terrytown is. Because in Breath of the Wild, you're the one who builds Terrytown, effectively. Oh. Yeah. Hateno. Center of fashion, Hateno. Ah, Luralyn, get me some hardy durians. Um, They're too powerful. You cook them up proper, you'll get a full restore in like 10 temp hearts or something silly. It's crazy. <sighs> Unfamiliar monsters since the upheaval. That's true, I've never seen a horriblin before. That was weird. Okay. 
Let me go up. Hookbub, hookbub, hookbub. Uh, where was armor? Ah, Buttercup's looking right at it. She could use some armor too, couldn't she? So poor. Wait, hold on. It is. Arrows and apples, too. Oh, she's from uh, presumably Luralyn. She looks like she's from Luralyn. Well, we're selling gemstones like I usually do at the beginning of the game. I don't need them yet. Uh. There we go. All of them. Uh. We're gonna put a cohesive outfit on. put something cohesive on ourselves something that actually covers our legs look at that we're not in a skirt anymore we do have this weird hood all right wait no buttercup we'll be back you stay here I got places to be apparently gotta tell Pura I'm ready to go I wish I could take my hood down. Like, I get it, but I wish I could take it down. Alright, Pura, let's go. Hmm. Uh -huh. We're going to space! The final frontier! Let's go! We're going up! We're finally dressed! Hey. Oh, just so tiny! You got it! Yeah! Her whole body weight! <laughs> okay! Oh, it lights up! Oh, that makes sense. The, um, the towers in Breath of the Wild were all lit. Not like this quite, but... Uh, but, um... Oh! Fun! Fireworks! Oh, because the towers don't need to rise from the earth. Not like they did last time. Oh, that's neat. Oh, fun. Okay, let's go up. Maybe we'll finally get the paraglider. I would love a paraglider about now. Because we get the feeling that if there's fireworks coming out of the top of this tower, that I'm also going to come out of the top of this tower. This would be... Oh, this would be exciting. Okay. The teleport pad's ready. Good. That is very impressive, Pura. They're about getting map data. Let's go. Yes, let me up. Let me up. Let me up. Uh -huh. hmm. Okay. Ma'am, please. Please don't keep me in... S yes! Let's go. <laughs> Our first test launch. Uh -huh. I have questions. Yeah. Okay. 
Okay, let's go up. Ah, uh, guardian arms, guardian arms, guardian arms. No? I'm with Link on this. Uh, question mark, question mark, question mark. At the same time, you know there, you know there's an artist. You know there's an artist somewhere. I was really excited about that particular shot. Oh. may sound wild, but this is legitimately how we used to, and in some cases how we still do uh, topography mapping. Oh, this is so cool. Imagine if you didn't have the paraglider, you'd immediately be... No, no, we're not gonna. What is that? That Nazca line looks like Rauru. And there's one up there, too. Ah, and a stable. Okay, we're going that way. I know I said I'd go to Kakariko, and I'm gonna. It's just, there's something going on up there, and I need to see what it is. It's real important. Okay, let's not die. I always manage to, like, mess this up. And by that, I mean, in Breath of the Wild, I died so many times. I just, like, fell over. Okay, we did it. Where did Kara? Where did where did she be? Is she at the tower? Oh no, she's back in her lap. Didn't stay to see if I'd make it. Uh huh. Me and Pura, come on. Yeah, I did. Huh. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yes, let's take a look at my map. Let's get a closer look at that snout. Hebra, Alvin, Gerudo, and then Lanryu. That's probably the order they want us to go in. Hmm. But I'm gonna level with you. I'm probably going to. Uh, I'm probably going to pirates first because it reminds me of Wind Waker. Oh, the game really wants me to go to Rito Village. Hmm. Uh, I guess I could go to Rito Village. But... Oh, the Lucky Clover's gonna help you, huh? Okay. Uh, I guess I'm going to Rito. Pura, you're so fun. I like you. Wait, where are you going, Joshua? Sorry, I didn't mean to run you over. Sorry, you can't talk now. There's something I gotta discuss. Research into chasms. Well, don't. Where are we going? You had the little thing over your head. A little quest marker. <laughs> oh, Robbie. Yes, it's true. I've got the Pura pad. We're not calling it the Robbie pad. <laughs> were you even listening to me? Yes, now what were you saying? Perfect. 
Whoa, don't jump in the chasm yourself. You'll hurt yourself. I did that and I died. I thought, I thought there would be a loading zone and I'd just be safe and I'd land on the ground and it would be okay. It was not fine. Spoiler, y'all, it was not fine. <laughs> but we're okay. And we're going to get to a stable and we're going to register Buttercup. My beautiful, beautiful horse. Okay. She's... All right, all right. You two are arguing. You saw a figure in the depths, eh? She's so excited to be here. Yeah. Okay, one of them caught your eye. That's certainly a statue. Hmm. Or maybe a guy I have to fight. Well, we'll see. People living in the depths, huh? Is this like the um the mirror world from Link to the Past? If we go down there, are there gonna be people down there? And is it gonna be like like if we go all the way to I don't know, Terrytown or whatever, are we gonna find out our house is a bomb shop? <laughs> Cause our house was a bomb shop. I remember that. Okay, let's go. At least this time we'll survive the landing. No, I don't know about the camera. Not in this game, apparently. Once we're down there, of course. Let's go. I'm going to leave Buttercup here. So that she's safe. Actually, hmm. Goggles me as well. Adorable. I have like 80 of those. I don't have like 80 of those. I'm gonna go down there, but first I want to register Buttercup because she's such a good horse. Have you seen her? Where are you, Buttercup? Buttercup. Oh, I left her by the shop. Buttercup! The other reason I want to rush just her Buttercup is so that I can stop going Buttercup uh, to the screen all the time. Um, so that she'll be registered and I can just whistle when I want her attention. Okay, the place I'm going is actually the opposite direction of this. Let's go, Buttercup. That's a whole tower over there. That's not the same tower either. That's not where I'm going either though. Okay, let's get to the road that I want to go on. It doesn't lead through that terrible cave, does it? Because that cave looks dangerous. And I wouldn't like to go there. Choo-choos! Oh, it's choose, and it definitely totally does. Or maybe... Buttercup, I'm sorry. I heard that. I want to go there. That's a sh shooting star. Oh, but it's so far. Uh, and it's only, well, maybe. Maybe I can make it. I have half an in-game hour. Yeah. Horses are pretty speedy. But I don't yeah. think... Yeah. 
Whoa! Sorry, Buttercup. I know you don't like to ride the inside rail. Let's go. Oh. All right, back we go. I did see a bloopy over there. Back to the road. I saw a bloopy that can that can be my consolation prize. If it's still there. Yep, it's still there. I I think I saw it for a split second, I thought. I'm gonna do something potentially crazy. I don't need to do the same. Well, no. Well, wait, maybe, will this work? Chat, I'm gonna tell you what I'm trying to do. What I'm gonna do is raise this up with Alter Hand as high as it will go. And then I'm going to drop it back down. And then I'm going to jump on it and use rewind. I said jump on it. And use rewind. And while it's up here, I'm going to jump off. Oh. Nice! Amazing! Buttercup, where are you going? Buttercup. Ma'am, horse. My good, good horse. We're not going into whatever that is. It looks like a den of monsters. And I don't want to find out if it is. It definitely is. That's also a den of monsters, but I'm willing to leave them be while I go on my adventure. I have a place to be. I marked it on my map. And I think it might be a stable where I can register Buttercup. Because it looked like a stable. It was built in the shape of the horse god. Oh, it's this guy again. Man, he gets around fast. What is shaking? Okay, maybe we're fine. Okay. No, we need this thing. <sighs> okay. We got that. You know what? We're gonna go crazy today. We're gonna we're gonna do this. Oh. Well, we'll actually have to go a little bit crazy. <laughs> that seems about right. Okay, okay, you can't stand here forever. You can let go, buddy. There you go. How's 
the president standing. Ah. Oh no, we'll never find out. Yeah, I just glued some stuff together, my man. Mm. They gave a gremlin super glue. Uh. Let me get in behind enemy lines. I'll show you what I'm about. Yeah, red rupee. Oh, bomb flower. Sweet. Ah. Oh, yeah, we're definitely not getting bombs as a power if bomb flowers are in the game. All right. Buttercup! We have places to be, ah. ma'am. I gotta register you as soon as possible so that people know that you're my horse and so that your name can officially be Buttercup. Yeah. Chat, I will absolutely let you name horses. What, what is it? No, 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 no! Run, run, run! Run! That is a tree! That is a tree that's alive! Okay. I did not like that. I did not like finding out that there are living trees. No, thank you. Oh, no. Buttercup, we're gonna put you... Where, where is safe? Okay, we are gonna kill a Hinox. I don't know how. Yeah, you better run, tree. Wait, hold on. <laughs> Whoa! Pumpkins? Is there somebody down here? Cook pot? Well proved more comfortable than I, than I expected. Not too hot, not too cold. Cozy, really, for a well. I had no need for heat-resistant chili ingredients or cold-resistant warm ones. I cooked for pleasure instead of survival. For a time, I considered tilling the soil in here, living off the land until the end of my days. But times have changed. The upheaval formed a myriad of new caves. Consider my curiosity peaked. Unexplored lands are a veritable buffet of cooking materials, and I, Ori Tamu, intend to dig in. If you seek fortune, keep moving. Chef Ori Tamu, master of cuisine, of course, of course. I see. All right. I'm picking your pumpkins. Yes, fortified pumpkins. That's defense up food. Oh, I saw that thing too late. Let's get something with a rock on it. There we go. Oh, oh, lizard, I saw you too late once again. All right. Let's just, uh, do I have anything metal? Uh, never mind, it doesn't matter. Link. link. I want to light this. Oh, you know what I could do, I guess? I got it! Now we can cook! Pumpkin! Um... There we go. We got a pumpkin. What do we want to put in that pumpkin? Let's put some meat in that pumpkin. Let's put some salt in that pumpkin. Uh, anything after the salt here is all monster parts and stuff, and those are not for cooking in food. Can we put some mushroom in the pumpkin? Let's cook the pumpkin. Cook in the pumpkin! Oh. Oh. Nice. 
Ah, let's put another pumpkin in. Why not? And I guess some herbs. That's... I love that he's humming songs from the series. I appreciate that. It's cute. Oh, now it's going to be stuck in my head. Ugh. What is this? Sunset Firefly? That will allow you to move more quietly. That's stealth. Well, let's check this in. Then we'll go get Buttercup. That's a Pona's theme. And the other one he's having is the main theme of Hyrule Field. I wonder if he has any more. As we just swim through the earth like it's totally fine and normal. Buttercup! Nope, we're not going back that way. Oh, you're right. No. You're absolutely right. We're going to sneak up on the Hinox. Which way is the wind blowing? Because there is, if we can kill this Hinox, we can take Buttercup and register her. Okay. I'm going to get out a Zonai device. And I'm going to fuse it to the Zonai sword. And it's going to be this. Nice. Buttercup, please be careful. I should build her a little buttercup pen. Buttercup, please don't get in the way of the Hinox. I don't want you to get hurt. Okay, okay, we are downwind of the Hinox. Now, we are going to try to do this in the same way that I've done this previously. I don't know if it'll work. Some game developers don't let things like this work, but we're going to get on his hand, and he's going to take us up to his belly. Okay, okay, put your hand down, buddy. You can do it, pal. Okay. Elevator up. Elevator up. Anytime now, bud. that it'll help me, but I would like a shield on. Thanks. Uh oh. Okay, so the trick with Hinox is hit him in the eye. Which I am apparently not good enough at. if you can still sneak under his butt. Buttercup, look out! Uh, sir? No! I know exactly what he's up to. Oh, 
Oh, look at me, ragdoll. Into the river. Wow. Okay, we're going to try that one more time. I should have saved directly before the Hinox. But I think it saves when you cook. So I think we might be okay. Yeah, it definitely did. All right, we're not even going to bother sneaking up onto his belly. Let me make sure that we're well equipped. That's the thing to equip. Okay. Now, there's one more thing we're going to do. Actually, we'll need to equip this. We're going to do this. Because oh, we could use some wood too. There. I'm not letting him wield that stuff like a club. I'll die before I allow that to happen. I did die before I let that happen. Oh, let's just heal up that one quarter heart. With a tasty sky shroom. <sighs> Alright, let's go, Hinox. I don't even care. I'm gonna wake this man up. Worth it. Okay, now I have to actually equip a weapon. Got him. Uh oh. Well, let's leave. Oh, do I even have enough weapons for this? I might not. I might have to take the weapons off his belly. That's right. I made some mistakes in what I did. The camera got weird. Come on, run! You did it, Link! Nice work! Oh, he's on to me now. Run, 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 run! run. Got him. Oh no, I'm out of stamina. Link. Link. Oh, <laughs> not equipped with anything. Uh oh, oh. Oh, that'll solve that problem then. How about this? Oh, that even got him right in the eye. Oh. Are we nice, nice. laying around.
what? This means we've opened the way to the stable. Anything here that I can pick up? Okay. Buttercup, guess what? We can go to a stable. Let's go. Oh, this is so excessive, Bloopy. Huh. Buttercup, I'm gonna need you to sort of help me out here. This is slightly rougher terrain, but I think if we can just scoop by up here, I can come down from that hill. And we can get ourselves a fine, fine bloopy. Oh. Yeah, it's still there. Oh no. Good idea. What do you want? Never heard of it. Sure. Oh, we saw those up. I don't actually care what they they drop. I think we saw those earlier. Well, I missed the bloopy, and I lost an arrow about it, but that's okay. Because that is stable. <laughs> that means we can register Buttercup. Let's go register Buttercup. I'm not a member yet. My name's Link, uh -huh. as everyone's name is. I already know what the stable system is. It's pony points. I got a card from a guy. I want to register Buttercup. Uh -huh. I did? Oh. First horse is free! I must have Breath of the Wild data on this device. Buttercup! Yes, huh. this is Buttercup. Ah. Oh. I know how pony ah. points work. Oh. You get pony points for doing stuff at the stable. That much is clear. Ah. Okay. Oh. Terms and conditions apply. Sir, who have I got uh -huh. in here? Huh. Oh. And Buttercup. Luca's a horse from a previous game. Temperament. Wild.
Well, Buttercup's the horse. The horse for me. Uh, sir, I would like to stay at your inn, your fine establishment. A regular bed, please. No, no, I'll pay. I want the pony points. You said there were rewards. We're gonna get rewards. Okay, so I'm at a serene state. You know what? Next thing I should do is find a tower around here. Yes! I love rewards. Let's go. Give me something nice. Oh. Okay. Okay. I like that it tells you where you can take stuff like that. Ma'am, what's your problem? Ah, her wagon sucks. <laughs> All right, ma'am, I'll help you. Where is the building materials cache around here? There's always one nearby. Oh, I better activate that. Ba -da 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 -do. I got octopus things to do. Hero things. We're gonna activate this. Do 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 do. Okay, it's activated. We're not gonna do it yet. I need to help that lady with her um with her wagon problem. <laughs> that that's not what I meant to do at all, but it's nice that it's shaped like an axe head. Beetle! I'll wait for you to get the stable. What's this? Ooh, a torch. That could come in handy later. <gasps> do dogs still lead you to treasure? Excuse me, was that a whole dragon up there? That's a whole dragon up there! We're not getting to that! Um, <laughs> no matter how much ascend we have. Okay, okay, okay. That's wheel number one. That's wheel number two. Uh -huh. It's magic. I magicked it back together with super glue. Yep, it's fixed. Do you need a horse? I can catch you a horse. Uh -huh. I did. Oh, her name is Zoomy. We're gonna give her the Zoomies. Mm. <sighs> what if I bring you one? There's horses around here, right? I mean, I can't give you Buttercup. Buttercup's my beautiful horse. There's definitely gotta be horses around here somewhere. There's great big old fields. Yeah, there's horses, but also there's this Nazca line. Keto, what's going on out here? Ooh. This guy is from uh, Breath of the Wild. He also lived in the Sheikah village. It's his job to look after Impa. Ooh. 
Okay, first we're catching a horse, though. We want to be downwind of any horse we catch. So that they don't smell us. Is that a hole? We're not... We're not going in the hole. That horse is going to see me, I'm worried. What do you think would be a nice horse for this lady? I think I want to catch the one with the dappled butt. Come here, you fine dapple gray. It's a lot of dragonflies. Ah, the wind has changed. That's unfortunate. Gosh darn. Oh, this horse let me on like immediately. I didn't even have to tame it. What a oh, this horse isn't very good, that's why. <laughs> I brought you a horse. Uh. Yeah, you can have this horse. I don't know anything about it. It's a horse. She's politely telling me how to hook up a horse. That's nice of her. <sighs> Beautiful. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Thank you, ma'am. <laughs> She's thinking about baby names. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Zunk. I hope she's okay. She did say she wanted to run a horse drawn shop, so I hope I hope she can. Now then, Beetle. Sir. Hey. I <laughs> Yes. Wow. Bugs of the highest quality and he'll buy stuff from me. That's good. Do I have anything I want to sell you? I don't have any gemstones because I already sold them. Just the two. <laughs> what have you got? <laughs> Arrows, fireflies. Okay. No, I think I'm good. <laughs> ah. What's this? Tomatoes and glow mushrooms make whatever that is. Tomatoes are in this game now. That's the name. Okay. Right, I better actually go do that shrine, and then I'm gonna go see Impa about whatever Impa's on about. It's probably plot. It's 
So let's actually do the shrine, and then we'll go bug Impa and see what she's going on about, what she's doing. Do, 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 do. An uplifting device. <laughs> okay, okay, so all of you need to know that the reason that I find it so funny that that's happening uh, is entirely because so Avatar The Last Airbender uh, has an episode that really stuck out in my mind because see <coughs> whoops okay good enough see um can I just do this? Like, will this work? Um. They go to an air temple and they expect to find airbenders, and instead they don't. Um. But. What. What ends up happening? is they basically build hot air balloons or rather are working on them and that they leave the prototypes behind and that is how the fire nation gets airships um and i've always wondered about that in other pieces of media like what happens to the stuff that you leave behind? And so when I was watching that episode, I was immediately like, ah, I see. Oh, that's going up. And it delighted me that the Fire Nation had airships like a little bit later in the series. That was, that was a lot of fun. Ooh, what's all this? I see a little ball. Oh, hole for a little ball, hole for a big ball. Woo! I didn't die! Woohoo! Wahoo! Okay. Hmm. Okay, there we go. Sorry, folks, something was up with my motion sensor for a second. Ah, I have a plan, I have a plan. Okay, so what we're gonna do is, where's the big ball? There must be a big ball around here somewhere. Oh, oh, there he is. Okay, so what we're gonna do is, we're gonna take this big ball. We're gonna glue the big ball to the center of this. We're gonna glue the little ball the, to the center of that. We're gonna glue a balloon to the little ball. Okay. Okay, now we've got the Tower of Shenanigans. Okay. Tower of shenanigans down. Now we look up and make sure that it's gonna hit something. Oh no, wait, it doesn't matter. It's actually better if it doesn't hit anything. We set the Tower of Shenanigans there. We turn this off. Horse can't hear me in here. Come on, Link. Get it together. this in the middle. Oh, there's no way I can... It's 
Not enough. You know what that means. <laughs> it means we need more power. Ah, darn it. Okay. More power. Link. I know it's my fault, buddy. Maximum firepower. I know it's uh, like B button, but I keep just doing it this way. Okay. Ha ha ha! My beautiful, beautiful, beautiful nonsense. It's working. Oh, oh, okay, okay, we're going up. Oh, right. <gasps> da, 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 da. We sat down nice and gentle. There we go. Thanks, buddy. Plunk. That's big ball o'clock. Amazing. And that's little ball o'clock. Excellent. Good work, team. We did it. Nice. Let's go see what the treasure is. I love treasure. Treasure! I'm gonna get everywhere. Into the treasure! Ooh, it's opal. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna get up to nonsense with balloons in the real world. Okay, let's get on out of here. Light of Blessing, very nice. Let's go. Oh, I should visit a statue. If I can find one. I know where there is one. There's one in the Temple of Time. I guess I did just activate the shrine. I suppose I could go right there. No, but Impa. Impa's got a, a thing for me to look at. She's got a sad tear for me to look at. Or... Er, No, this isn't a tear. This is a geoglyph. What am I thinking? I'm thinking of Rauru. <laughs> he, he did not seem like he was okay. It, The grass is legitimately just like... That's cool. It's, it's not bent down or anything. It's just a different color. Ooh. Oh, like a mushroom. Okay, Impa, what's uh, what's going on? Oh, oh, she's such a wizzled old lady. She's so tiny. Okay. Yeah, it's a mystery. Oh. She's fine. I'm sure she's fine. 
She's definitely fine, guys. It's probably fine. Huh. Okay. So we've got, like, Nazca lines. Oh. Uh. Completely sheared the... Oh, wow. Okay, let's fix it. We can fix it. Oh. All right, ma'am. I did it. All right, Impa? She wouldn't let me talk to her. Yes. What do I need? Oh, fire. Is there anything fire lightable? Uh, okay. I have a torch. Maybe there's fire back here at the stable. I mean, I guess I could... Uh, like, I don't know. I guess I could, like... Throw a fire pot at it, but... I could also just light a torch. And not frighten the heck out of her. Hopefully this doesn't catch all the grass on fire. Just saying that's a very real concern of mine. Is that it will catch the entire geoglyph on fire. There we go. We're going up. What are we going to see up here? Custom. Oh. Yeah, okay, it looks like Robert. Hey, one of his eyes is filled in. Hmm. Dragon's Tears. Where the tears rest upon the earth, we marked down the images to which they gave birth. Huh. That's Rauru, probably. It looks like him, anyways. Are you sure you can manage a landing? Because, like... <gasps> this is pretty sweet. Is she actually doing coming down? Where did the balloon go? Oh! Ground's coming up on me pretty quick. Faster than I would normally like. But, like, I see that. Why is this filled in up here? Oh, I guess I can't burn it. It's just this weird... Like, what? What is this? It's... It's almost got a liquidy texture to it, but it's... It's not quite. Oh yeah, she made it down. Alright, let's go see what this tear's about. Whoa! My controller vibrated. What is this? What have we got here? Blorp! Ah! We did 
didn't mean to startle you. I'm sorry. It's okay. My name is Sonia. Hello. And could we ask what your name is? You didn't tell me I, yours. I am the daughter of King Rome of Hyrule, Zelda. What an unexpected answer. <laughs> we are the king and queen who founded Hyrule, after all. Or at least we were the last time I checked. You two founded Hyrule? And you're the king? Mm. My name is Raru. King Raru of Hyrule. King Raru? And Queen Sonia? But that must mean... Chat, remember how you were like... There's time travel? Well... I think we got it. I think we figured it out. I think we've discovered what's going on. We know where Zelda is. We shouldn't have asked where. We should have asked when did she go to. Number three, huh? Okay. A little bit weird. Okay. Now a vision of the lost princess. Sure is. Okay. Okay. Well, let's carry on then. Okay. And it's just started to rain. We can see the tower in the distance. Let me just mark that next one. That's where we're headed next. All right. So, um, that's the end of the night. I am not going to accidentally play till one in the morning this time. I did that last time. We won't do it again. What I am going to do is take you all off on an adventure um, because, and I didn't expect this, uh, one of the folks I routinely go and visit uh, is also playing Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. So we're going to head over there. Oh. Nope, I lied. <laughs> He's playing uh, Link to the Past, so we're gonna go. We're gonna go back in time ourselves. All right, off we go.